Hello and welcome. Get ready. It's time for the preliminary final. Could not ask for better conditions for finals footy. Collaborating with me in the commentary booth is Gary Lyon. Welcome, Gaz. G'day, Hunter. Today's an exciting match. In some ways, these prelims are more nerve-wracking than the grand final itself. No tomorrow for the loser. It's going to be a pressure-filled game with all on the line. Great sides are made in prelim finals. It's a chance to prove you are worthy of being there at the big dance. Hitting the turf today will be Collingwood and North Melbourne. North Melbourne looking ready as they enter the ground. The banners look great as the players get set to run through them. Both four lines are in for a big day here. This could be a high-scoring affair, and both sides would want to make the most of their chances inside field. They run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp, and the crowd are appreciating it. The banners are ready for the players. Captains at both sides make their way to the middle for the coin toss. The Magpies kicking to the right of screen. Just waiting for the opening siren now. And here's the bounce to launch the festivities. Hammers it, is in his possession. Just kicks it long. Off hands. Dug out by Tarrant. Gets the handball away. He wins possession. Takes that one strongly. Keeps it moving. Atley dug out the loose ball. Gets the loose ball. Got hands to it. The loose ball scooped up quickly onto the boot. Cox marks in a bit of space. He delivers with a drop punt. He celebrates hard after that. He's kicked the first goal. Centre bounce. Thumps it clear. The ball spells the hole. Grundy can't hold on to the tackle. Clears the congestion. That doesn't look good. He must be injured. That doesn't look good. I don't think he'll be coming back. North Melbourne behind by five. Ready to bring it back into play. Decides to play on. Slams it on the boot. The mark is taken by side bottom. Hacks it forward. Doing well to intercept that kick. Goes the long option. Ends up turning this ball over. Scharenberg uses it by foot. Great mark in the pack. Kick by McDonald. Stuck the mitts out there and held on to it. Just gets a hand in. Soccer's the kick. Garner scoops it up. Chris gets the loose ball. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Opportunity now for Zeebel. 50 metres out. 
Probing kick inside the 50. Hall looks to get under the football. Bit too casual with the tackle. Grundy throws the ball away. Going for goal number one. What a sensational goal. Cunnington loves that goal. They've hit the front. Back in the middle as the Rucks go at it. Big thump from Goldstein. With the ball now. Picked off the deck. Tyson just threw it. Ruffe drives it long. Taken well at ground level by Chris. Langdon drops the mark. It'll be a ball up on the outer wing. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? This is a classic game you're seeing right now. Just gets a boot to it. Sweeping handball. Pendlebury just put it on the boot. McKay, a bit of mop up. Ball hits the deck. Brown slips high and gives away the free kick. Chips it towards half forward. A chance to gather the ball. Tarras clears the congestion. The ball finds Holick. He drives it. A solid mark from Kennington. Goes with the kick. Open opportunity for Brown. Uses it by foot. A good mark out of the circumstances. towards centre half forward scoops it up Brown running off for a break umpire tosses it in Swatson Garner picks up the loose ball gives the old don't argue he just throws that ball Chris with a low spearing kick Zeeble the better man there he lays off the pass. Garner just bangs away at goal. Wow! How good was that? He puts through his first goal. He acknowledges the crowd. The Roos plead Collingwood 13 to 6. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. A great bit of play that resulted in that goal. Back in the middle to resume play. Punches are clear. The ball mopped up. Hurry kick. Drops the mark. Fights the good fight. They can create from this. Main dug it out. Wins the race to the ball. Movement by hand. Didn't get away from that tackle. Great attack on the ball carrier. Gets around Mr. Invisible. Nice. Found some space and marked. Ten metres out. The drop punt sails between the big sticks. A second goal in the bag. Smiles all round. They are within a kick. It's great to watch Hutto. Plenty of excitement. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. Umpire ready to resume play. Punched away. Adams decides to soccer it. Gathers it now. The ball goes to ground. Picked up now. He's got the footy in his hands. Hits the target by hand. Puts boot to ball. Anderson gets in a good position. They create the turnover. Good grab there from Chris. With a driving kick. Side bottom. Hangs onto that one. Moves the ball by foot. A race for the loose ball. Hands that ball to the opposition. Sharon Burke takes a strong mark. Sharon Burke has resources out wide. 
Anderson shows some physicality. The free for Anderson. Looks up with the kick. Brown leading the race to the loose ball. Finding the ball was Hoskin Elliott. Finds the loose ball. This kick will put them in front. Main looking to track down the footy. Hoskin Elliott collects the loose ball. Looks like we'll have a throw in. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? I'm really enjoying this one, Hutto. Just put it on the boot. A good job keeping it in play there. Grundy didn't mark it. Langdon just releases the handball. Sinks the slipper into it. Cox has it. Wouldn't want to miss these opportunities. They could take the lead here. A time to celebrate. And don't they get around Cox. They've taken the lead. About to resume play. Clears the contest. Trelaw comes away with the ball. Keeps it moving. Langdon on the ball. Receives the handball and takes off. Good mark by Cox. 15 metres out. Moving on. He takes aim. A drop back through the goal. Skull number four with that kick. Cox enjoying that goal. Collingwood with the ascendancy over North Melbourne, leading 24 to 13. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. We're back in the middle now. Thump clear. A chance for Trelaw. Finds a target. Collingwood have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. 50 metres out. Going for goal number one. What a goal! excited about that one. Collingwood have kicked the last four goals. Now they lead by 17. Thrashes it. Ball stripped in the tackle. Grundy gains possession. Quick hands and they could be away here. Kicks hurriedly. Picked up by Chris. Just dismisses his opponent. He just can't get out of the action. Thomas marks. Now with a low spearing kick. McDonald couldn't stick the tackle. Trelaw going for number two. Couldn't quite with the mark. Collects the loose ball. Blinking by hand. Thomas celebrates with the fans. Collingwood Lee is now 23. He knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. He did really well there and gets the reward. We resume hostilities. Winning it was Grundy. Anderson controls this one. A great defensive effort. Couldn't snaffle it. Higgins tries his luck at goal. It looked impossible, but he made it work. They get around him after that effort. North Melbourne get it back under three goals. About to resume hostilities. Grundy gets onto the ball. Difficult ball control. He has the ball. Cunnington does get the handball away. Goldstein just threw it. Cox has resources out wide. Adams got hands to it. Slams it under the boot. Great mark. Moves it by foot. It's marked by Walker. Gets a quick kick away. Marked by Hall. A chance here to convert North Melbourne. 
Intercepted. Has it now. Maynard just handballs into space. The contest, no match for him. I agree with you there, Hutto. Uses it now. Cox with the mark. He gives it a ride. Main couldn't snap it. Dug out the loose ball. McKay goes with the kick. Beam with an opportunity for the turnover. He gets above the crowd. 25 metres out. Going for goal number one. Kept his head and kicked the goal. He's enjoying every second of it out there. Majek, love kicking that one. Collingwood with a handy break. They lead the Ruse 42 to 19. Doing well was side bottom. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? There's not enough effort out there at the minute. Grundy keeps it moving. Barco will be the recipient of the free. Chips it towards half forward. Tarrant dropped what he should have taken. Ball gets cut off. Rushes with the kick. McKay couldn't hang on to the ball. Going for goal number two. <laughs> Collingwood by 24. Collingwood are costing themselves with turnover today. They need to find a way to control the play better and stop turning it over. Over the top of the pack. Got boot to ball. Atley runs after this one. Beams with the ball. Fantastic tackle. Listen to the roar of the fans. They love that decision. Spears the ball. A big contested grab. Might be too far out to score. Dugowie going for number one. Nails the goal. This kick has extended their lead. He's enjoying that goal. 30 points the difference. Only seconds remaining in this quarter. Grundy thrashes it. This is Phillips. Anderson unable to lay the tackle. Wants to keep it moving. He might kick a goal. No issues with that drop punt. Dugowie gets number two. Gets some reward for his efforts. Collingwood by six goals. We're back in motion. Hammers it. Taken by Grundy. Plenty to analyze from that first quarter, Gas. Collingwood could have to be happy with that first term. Out of the blocks for the high scoring opening term. I wonder what lies ahead. Let's check out the stats. North Melbourne are allowing the opposition too much room on the outside. They need to close them down faster once they break away. Thank you, Gaz. The second term ready to get underway. Back in the middle now. Grundy got a fist to it. Pendlebury gets a quick kick away. Scoops up the ball. He heads for home. Adam sends the drop pun on its way for another goal. Set of the nerves, gets his first on the ball. They increase their lead. Pretty happy with that one. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. That's a really good team goal. North Melbourne are going to struggle to get back into this game if they continue to kick poorly in front of goal. Chips it towards half forward. Majek grabs that one. This will have to be his very best kick to score from this far. Marks now and can send it back. McKay kicks it. Dawn takes the mark and contested. Collingwood just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Beam throws the ball away. Tara got under it. Chose to kick it. Picks up the loose ball. Clear free. Just put both hands in the back. He gives chase to the footy. Pushes off the tackler. It'll be a free kick for that high tackle. McKay has resources out wide. A great mark taken there. Jamal pumps the ball long. 
takes a simple grab. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Collingwood, forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. Decides to kick. Finds a bit of room to mark. McDonald moves it now. Out of bounds, right on the 50. Well, this game's really getting out of hand. Toss back into play. Grundy thumps it forward. McKay just gets a boot to it. Atley pushes his opponent off with one hand. Higgins onto the ball. Takes possession. Seen plenty of it. The kick from Cannington. Garner can bring the fans alive with this kick. His teammates rush over. The ruse reduced the margin. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. North Melbourne have struggled to get the ball forward to centre. Look at the inside 50 difference. They're getting well beaten. Fantastic chase and tackle. Fails to fend off the tackler. Fantastic pressure there. Hacking it out of there. Goes for territory. Off the ground. And it's a goal for Simpkin. That's his first. He loved that one. That's two in a row for North Melbourne. It's still an uphill battle. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. It's great to watch, Hutto. Plenty of excitement. North Melbourne are creating plenty of chances from turnover. They just need to generate that into more scoring opportunities to be a big chance. Constant pressure and rewarded. Goldstein rushes with the kick. The tackle slipped high and results in a free. Looks to move it by foot. He takes the mark. Winds up and goes long. Beam with an easy mark. Collingwood are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Celebrating hard. North Melbourne close the gap to 24. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. North Melbourne can't get their hands to the footy. If they can win more of the ball, then they can get back into this game. Slick with the hands. Links with hands. He's got the football now. Finding the ball with ease. A chance to reload the attack now. Moved on by Durden. Tyson wins the ball in the air. Goes by foot. Marks in a bit of space. The tackle deserves the free and gets it. Langdon creates all sorts of problems for his opponents. Coaches love to see that kind of tackling pressure. Uses a short handle. Ball spills. Ball collected. Cunnington keeps coming. Showing some really good pressure there. The loose ball picked up. Tarrant wants to keep it moving by hand. Just leaves them in his wake. Great goal. Congratulated by his teammates. North Melbourne now only trailed by 18. A great bit of play that resulted in that goal. This is how they can score Big Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. He gets his hands on the footy. Ends up with Cannington putting his skills on display. <laughs> McKay making his way onto the field. Ball up on the outer side wing. 
What do you make of the game so far, Gary? This is a great game, Hutto, and you can just sit back and enjoy it. Ruffin with a big fist on it. Use the hands and gives away the free. Trelaw puts it on the boot. Does well to cut off the kick. Anderson manufactures a handball. Finds this and marks well. 35 metres out. A chance to put a second goal on the board. Simpson narrowly misses there. North Melbourne reduced the margin. Collingwood could turn the ball over a lot trying to play aggressively. It's where they turn it over which doesn't make it as dangerous. Ball to be tossed back in. Ball back into play. Grundy hurls it away. Chris gains some territory. Anderson gathers it now. Mops up the loose ball. Trelaw blinks up with a chance to run. Handballs. McKay hacking it out of there. Great tackling there, Hello. Put his body on the line. Appleby turns a free. He spears the ball. Intercepts the ball well. Garner a long way out. Garner has resources out wide. Just gets it onto the boot. Gains some territory. Hacking it out of there. Sharon Burke had it, lost it. Looking to kick goal number two. Simpkin getting the crowd involved. North Melbourne have kicked the last five goals. The Roos close the gap to 11. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. North Melbourne are doing a great job of applying pressure and creating turnovers. It's allowing them plenty of opportunities. They just need to convert those into scores. Sear got the hands free. Jamont short by hand. Coughed up by Moore. Sharon Burke releases by hand. Chris sends it into space. It's a turnover. Appleby got him high there. Opportunity once again for North Melbourne to put one through. Pollock right on the edge of his range. Going for goal number one. Simpkin spills it. Getting in the way was Chris. Moore moves it by hand. And now they're away. Langdon marks uncontested. Puts it on the boot. Gets into a good position to take them. Sick with a short hand pass. Can't take possession. Grundy just gets it onto the boot. McDonald cuts it off. Terrific mark there. Garner with a drilling ball. It's a foot race to get this one. Sweeping handball from Moore. Just put it on the boot. Marks all of them. Elects to kick. Steady hands there as he holds that one. Collingwood are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Zeeble drives the kick. Pollock takes it well. Quick handball. McKay, hurried kick. Hurried kick. Clean pick up by Simpkin. Pendlebury coming onto the ground. The umpire calls for the ball now. What can you tell us, Gaz? It's a really entertaining game of football. A chance to put a second goal on the board. It somehow fits over the line, and it's a goal! Look at him, he really enjoyed that one. The slimmest of margins in this. He knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. He did really well there, and gets the reward. Collingwood are gaining a lot of their advantage through some smart kicks and even better marking inside their forward 50. The handball now from Tia, gathered by Higgins. Penetrating handball. Couldn't get the hand pass away, so he just threw it.
Adams goes for home. Summed it up, and he delivers perfectly. Look at them celebrate that effort. The margin is 11. Rough end clears the contest. Off hands from Varco. Scoops up the ball. Going for goal number one. That's a big lead. That would have been a big goal. Collingwood by two goals. Considering the options on the kick in. Main flicks it over. Loses control of the ball. Adams might kick a goal. Hits the post and it's a behind. Collingwood doing well at the moment. Collingwood have turned it over too often today. They aren't coping with the pressure. They should try and slow it down and control the ball for a moment. Jacobs elects to kick. Higgins does well to mark. Uses it now. And the mark will be paid. Releases by hand. McDonald just dismisses Thomas. Pendlebury collects it. Good mark and looks to send it back. Kicks the ball deep. Mark by Jamont. Puts it on the boot. Higgins takes the mark. Collingwood haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning title that way. Does well to cut off the kick. Maynard with a penetrating handball. Collected by side bottom. Goes by hand. Jamont struggling to run at the moment. To go in with quick hands. He can take off after that handball. Dog missed an opportunity to mark. Thomas puts another one through. Puts his second on the ball. Look at him. He really enjoyed that one. Collingwood lead by 19. Back with another centre bounce. Punches it clear. Picks up the loose ball. Looks up with the kick. The loose ball picked up. Looks like he might be hurt at the moment. Gaz, can you give us more on that? He's coming from the ground now, Hutto, but it didn't look great. Just threw the ball. This is kickable by his standards. Normally a good shot on goal. Going for goal number one. He's really turning it on now. He celebrates hard after that. Collingwood beginning to apply their supremacy on the scoreboard with a lead of 81 to 56. That's a really good team, though. He did really well there and gets the reward. North Melbourne can't afford to be missing this many chances in front of goal. It might cost them the game. Goldstein gets in the way. He flicks it over. Jamont quickly out of the boot. Turner hammers it at goal. Brilliant stuff. And he puts it through. He's got a couple now. Starting to get into this game. Celebrating hard. He knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. The game is back underway. The Magpies needs to be more aware of the opposition set up at the stoppage. Their hitouts are getting cut off too easily. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? There's some great skills on display right now. It's a great match. Tyson will have to put everything into this one. Going for goal number one. Unbelievable. And they put it through. They get around him after that effort. Margin within touching distance. We're back in the middle now. Goldstein won the hit out. Adams clears the ball from the contest. The ball ends up with Tarrant. Goes by foot. Dugowie goes off the ground. We'll get a ball up. 
Goldstein just swats it away. Couldn't get the hand pass away, so he just threw it. That's it for the first half. What can you tell us, Gaz? It's been a promising first half for Collingwood. They'd be confident they can keep it going in the second half. Anything to add, Gaz? North Melbourne still trail, but at least they're taking their opportunities in front of goal. Thanks. An interesting first half. Let's see how the third quarter pans out when we return from after our halftime break.
The third quarter about to get underway. We're back in the middle. Thrashes it. He gains possession. Finding the loose ball was Williams. Goes short by hand. Turner doesn't take the mark. Dug it out. Langdon finds a way to hang on. Beautiful tackle, Hutto. Doing well with the mark. Gets a hand in. And now they create a turnover. Williams elects to kick. Chris couldn't keep his hands on it. At full stride, receives the handball. Zeeble takes it well. What can you tell us, Gaz? I'm liking what I'm seeing at the moment, Hutto. A great game of football. The possession caused a turnover. Cleanly picked up. Hoskin Elliott slams it onto the boot. Gathers it now. A lot of possessions for him. Great tackling technique. Up for grabs for Grundy. Has it now. Unbelievable effort. And it ends with a goal. Barco puts his first goal on the ball. Look at them celebrate that effort. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. That's a really good team goal. It's been a clearance game, and right now, the Magpies go on top in that area. Pendlebury gives it to the player running past. Goes with the kick. Great grab. Moves the ball by foot. Collects the loose ball. A low stabbing kick. Lost concentration for a moment. Beam kicks hurriedly. Easily takes the mark. Dugowie uses it by foot. Hoskin Elliott marks it. Moves the ball along the wing. Couldn't take it. McDonald having an impact again. Yes, I know. He's a class act. He can take off after that handball. High tackle. Barco kicks the ball deep. Turned it over. Just gives it away. Langdon will be upset with that. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. You're right, Hutto. He's gone missing lately. Intercepted by Tarrant. Missed the target. Cunnington fends off the tackle. Beams read it best. Got the hands free. He drives it. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Yeah, he's having a real quiet match on it. What a lovely goal from there. Get some rewards for his efforts. The Magpies with the edge right now over North Melbourne. Thumps it clear. Grundy might have overworked himself there. Slams it on the boot. Finds himself in space and marks. Collingwood just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Intercepts the ball very well. Elects to kick. Simply outplayed his opponent. Moved on by Kendalbury. The mark has been taken. Heads long with that kick. Marks now and can send it back. Chris drives the kick. He wins the ball in the air. He's the number one ranked player on the ground. The opposition need to get a hold of him. Just got the hands in the back there. Chose to kick it. Ends up turning this ball over. Uses it by foot. Garner takes the mark. With a driving kick. Strong with the body and wins the mark. Goldstein going for number one. That one rams into the post. North Melbourne now only trailed by 24. Deciding where to go with the kick in. He decides to go for home. Smiles all round. North Melbourne behind by 18. And we're back in motion. Clears the contest. Phillips grabbed it clean. Hands that ball to the opposition. Goldstein dismisses his opponent with disdain. Decides to kick. 
Dugovic spills it. Fought hard to get a handball away. Intercepted. Cox couldn't stick the tackle on. Jermont marks that ball uncontested. Moves it by foot. Takes an uncontested mark. Puts boot to ball. Moore winds up and goes long. Picked up by Door. He likes his chances from here. Touched over the line. Langdon to bring it in. Takes the mark. Looks to move it by foot. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Gets it away. Takes possession. Anderson pushes through with power. He's got the football now. He gets his hands on the footy. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? I'm loving what this game is giving us right now. He's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. Going for goal number three. A chance to suffer it and kicks the goal. Turner celebrating hard. North Melbourne could kick back-to-back -back goals. North Melbourne reduced the margin. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. Collingwood are getting more of the ball on the outside, and it's their outside run that is generating plenty of scoring opportunities. Great tackle. McKay wins the foot race. Releases the handball. Durden kicks it. A strong mark in the pack from Chris. Collingwood have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. Kick by Cannington. Lining up for goal number four. Turner wouldn't be happier with that goal. North Melbourne have three in a row. Oh, there's nothing in this now. A great bit of play that resulted in that goal. Collingwood can be very damaging if you allow them time and space. They've been able to find space way too easily today. Side bottom, just throw it. Doing well to intercept that kick. Majek goes with the kick. Great mark under pressure. Sinks the slipper into it. Stands tall and marks. Gets a touch to the ball. Contest the hard ball. Jacobs just too high with the tackle. Langdon looks to convert this opportunity. 60 metres out. Good mark. And looks to send it back. Hall puts it on the boot. Strong mark in the contest. Decides to go to the middle. They chase after the loose ball. Goes short by hand. And now Pollock. Finds the loose ball. It's a turnover. Dug out the loose ball. Put the kick wide and a behind. The ruse behind by four. Langdon ready to bring it back into play. Adley controlling the airwaves on this occasion. 40 metres out. He goes it alone. Can't quite stick through. And only a behind. North Melbourne close the gap to three. Looking for options now. Adams gets on the end of this. Got boot to ball. A chance to reload the attack now. Garner heads long with that kick. Pollock presents and takes the mark. He's a long way from home, but he might have the wheels. Big moment to get the lead with this kick. Good body work to win the mark. The kick from Moore. Finds this one all by himself. Uses it now. Sharon Berg gets on the end of this. 
tries to gain some territory. Jacobs coming on. And now we'll have a ball up. A critical stage of this one. Punched away. Finding the loose ball was Heisen. Good mark there. Turn up to have the shot from outside 50. A 45 degree angle for this shot at goal. This for goal number five. He's put it through. He's enjoying that goal. North Melbourne go back in the lead again. It's great to watch Hutto. Plenty of excitement. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. Collingwood have been poor with their ball use. They've turned it over on too many occasions and it's allowing the opposition chances to score. Quickly onto the boot. Goes off the deck and through. Pretty happy with that one. Collingwood goes back into the lead. About to resume hostilities. Grundy with the punch. Somehow got the ball out. Hits him hard. Well collected. Right. There'll be a ball up in the center square. Grundy with the hit. Advances through the tackle. Tarrant didn't mark it. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Well, he hasn't had the impact we were expecting. Tarrant doesn't get low enough and gives away the free. Move it on. Going for goal number two. What a kick, and he puts it through. Varko couldn't be happier with that goal. Collingwood have kicked the last two goals. The lead is now nine. Thump by Grundy. Opportunity for Beams. Ball gets cut off. Tyson sees off Trelaw. Garner hits for home. He's excited about that one. North Melbourne now only trailed by three. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. North Melbourne giving themselves a chance on the turnover, but they can't seem to be putting it on the scoreboard. The loose ball scooped up. McDonald just put it on the boot. Anderson takes it strongly. Punches the kick. Tyson wins the ball in the air. Puts it on the boot. Barco used the body to take that mark. Drives the kick hard. Anderson looking a bit sluggish out there. At full stride, receives the handball. Walker wins the foot race, receives the handball and takes off. Lucky to be on the receiving end of that decision. Marking in space for Zagoe. 45 metres out. Goes for the goals. Puts it right through the middle. Three goals for him now. A time to celebrate, and don't they get around to going. The margin is nine. Back in the middle to resume play now. Thump clear. Pollock made the tricky bounce look easy. Jacobs moves it now. He has to hold onto those. Mops up the loose ball. Manages to get a hand away. With quick hands. Gives it to Goey. He has the ball. Grundy is getting the ball again and again. Sear decides to play on. Barco was surrounded, he needed to mark it, and he did. Elects to kick. Nice work for Maynard. Maynard has resources out wide. Quick handball, Tarrant has the ball. The ball spells for Jarenberg. Simpkin, and there's the siren to end the third quarter. The scores, Collingwood 111. 
to North Melbourne, 102. The Magpies will want to keep the foot on the accelerator and finish this last quarter strong. Congratulated by his teammates. Pendlebury continues to dominate this contest. He is dominating this game. Last quarter action, ready to go. They need to get a move on if they're going to win from here. About to resume play. Goldstein thumped it clear. Thank It'll be a ball up. It's a big stage of this game. Goldstein thumps it clear. Ball up in the centre square. Spots it. Higgins just fends off his opponent. Dishes it off. He wins possession. Lucky to score with that shot. North Melbourne close the gap to two. Searching for a teammate. The ball mopped up. Slams it onto the boot. The ball finds its way out of play. The umpire will throw it in. The ball is coming back into play. Using every ounce of energy he has left. Trelaw in a spot of bother. Big tackle. Manufactures a handball. Found a way to keep balanced. Giving it off with Chris. Takes a simple grab. Uses it by foot. Intercepts the ball very well. With a driving kick. Good mark there. McDonald drives the kick. Pollock Pull determined to reach the ball. A clean picker. Hoskin Elliott just gets it onto the boot. Through for a point. The Magpies by three points. Unsure of their next move. Gets a quick kick away. Well taken at ground level. Dawg collects the kick. Nice mark under pressure. Slams it on the boot. The mark is taken by Adams. That's something to smile about. His teammates rush over. Collingwood doing well at the moment. Punched away. The ball in the hands of Turner. Pendlebury drives it out of the pack. De Goey did well to win that ball. It has to be a big kick to get it from there. They can take the sting right out of the game here. An impressive performance so far. This for a fourth goal. He acknowledges the crowd. The Magpies by 15 points. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. Intervening brilliantly was Cunnington. <laughs> Pendlebury coming off for a spell. And the umpire says, my ball. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? It's a really good contest out there right now, and it's great to watch. Adley finds possession. Getting pushed out of the way was Maynard. Found space for an easy mark. 40 metres out. Garner with a pretty easy kick. Four goals to his name so far. Looking for a fifth. He just loved that one. Just under two goals. The difference now. Umpire ready to resume play. Thumps it clear. Applies a bump. They can create from this. Rushes with the kick. Takes a nice mark. Moore uses it by foot. Now we'll get a ball up. Rough end. Thumped it clear. Is in his possession. That's the sort of goal that can get the team up and about. He's excited about that one. The Ruse could kick back to back goals. North Melbourne behind by three. Back with another set of bounce. Rough it. Thumps it clear. Fighting hard was Brown. 
takes the mark all by himself. Goes behind. North Melbourne reduced the margin, looking to bring it back into play. Wins the race to the ball. Gets the loose ball. Phillips links for the teammate who can run. Pendlebury puts it on the boot. Doing well to intercept that kick. McKay kicks it. A race for the loose ball. He's put it out on the fall. Pendlebury goes with the kick. He couldn't hang on. Gathered by Maynard. A mark by Tarrant. Got boot to ball. Just manufactures what he could. He's on fire at the moment, Gaz. He's everywhere at the moment. Practicing some fancy moves. Garnet moves it by hand. He gains possession. <laughs> Terrific mark there. Decides to kick. Just gives it away. Turner able to release the kick. Lining up for goal. The kick will be from a 45 degree angle. They'll regain the lead if he nails this one. Adley enjoying that goal. They're in front. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. This is how they can score Big Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. Collingwood are finding plenty of the ball in space, but they're struggling to convert it to scores. If they can improve their ball use, they'll be right in this game. And we'll get a ball up. Ball, it's tense out there at the moment, Hutto. Grundy hurls it away. The loose ball picked up. Langdon over the top. Decides to play on. Doesn't hold on to the mark. Dawg gets the loose ball. Stabs at the kick. Gets into some space to mark this. Adams took his eyes off the ball. The umpire calls for it. Grundy won the hit out. Puts boot to ball. Majek slowing down now. Might be in need of a rest. Appleby has a teammate on the move. Taking a nice grab. 40 metres out. This is a big kick in the contest of this game. A kick to hit the front. Cox celebrating hard. Collingwood take back the lead. The game is back underway. Goldstein clears the contest. And the mark will be paid. Holling moves it now. A chance to gather the ball. Grundy shuts him down. Brilliant chase. Chris gives the old don't argue. Lobs the handball. Thomas gets the ball. Finds his man. Here's the rough end. It's cut off by Dantley. Puts on a big hit. Kick by Williams. Finds the loose ball. Outstanding pressure. He's got the footy in his hands. We'll get a ball up on the wing. Hammers it with the ball as Jacobs dishes it off. Hall, hurry kick. Higgins got hands to it. Kicks hurriedly. The loose ball scooped up. Penetrating handball. Goldstein wins it back. Darts it through for another. His teammates rush over. They're in the lead now. Centre bounce. Punches it clear. With the ball now. Barco found a way to mark that one. Can he put it through? The trip pass goes straight between the big sticks. Pretty happy with that one. Collingwood are back in front. We resume hostilities. 
clears the contest. Pendlebury now. He looks like he needs a spell. A bit too hard with a push. And it's a free kick. A long driving kick. The mark is taken by Sia. Kicks it long. An easy grab for Dugowie. That's holding the ball. Putting on the pressure was McKay. Outstanding pressure. Durden tacks it into the pocket. McDonald with an easy mark. Sinks the slipper into it. Dawn needs a chance to rest. Has a man running for him. Takes possession. A strong pack mark. Moved on by Durden. Jacobs hacking it out of there. Mops up the loose ball. Now it's a ball up. The players will be feeling it out there. Ruffin with a big fist on it. Releases the handball. Lobs the handball. Missed the target. Cunnington getting a chance for a break. Thump clear. Hall just manages to release the kick. McDonald takes aim. Just couldn't get it to curve enough. The margin is now under a goal. Players move as they look to provide an option. Langdon releases the ball. Huge opportunity to grab the lead. The scores are level. What a nail biter. Teammates break for him. Now we've got a ball up. Thrashes it. Kept alive under pressure. Does well to get it out. And now Jarenberg. Appleby kicks out of the congestion. Hoskinelli has a great set of hands. He flicks it over. Turned it over. Gets it away. Langdon Campbell's to no one in particular. Ball gets cut off. He lays off the pass. Intercepted. Big thumb from Grundy. Off the deck. Gathers it now. Dugowie pulls the trigger. The kick towards goal. Started the kick wide. And it never came back. The Magpies, 137. Lead North Melbourne, 136. Kicks it out of the back half. Anderson marks. Goes with the kick. Marking in space was Walker. Moves it by foot. He gives chase to the footy. Keeps it moving. McDonald gets the ball. Trelaw is streaming past and gets the footy. Has to do better in that mark contest. Drives it long. Dug out the loose ball. Needs a bit of a rest. The kick from Dorn. The mark has been taken. Zeeble sends one up towards the wing. Higgins controlling the airwaves on this occasion. Elects to kick it long. Takes the mark. Chose to kick it. Side bottom takes a strong mark. Looks up with the kick. Grundy wins the marking contest. Moves the ball by foot. Walker goes off the ground. Using every ounce of energy he has left. The contest, no match for him. That's true, Hutto. Keeps the kick low. Brown quickly onto the boot. Nice hands. Jamal gets the opportunity to have a shot for goal. Looks to move it by foot. They chase after the loose ball. Beam sockers it forward. Walker puts on a bump. McKay there to mop up with the ball now. Gets the loose ball. He's having a big game right now. He's showing everyone how it's done. Lots of pressure out there at the minute. Grundy gets onto the ball. Wins the race to the ball. Gone! What a tackle! Side bottom attracted a crowd. Great tackle. North Melbourne threw everything at them, but they couldn't get over the line. 
What stood out for you today, Gaz? It's such a confidence-building win. If you get out of a game like this with a win, it makes you think you can achieve anything. At the end of the match, the scores are Collingwood 137 to North Melbourne 136. That's the end of today's broadcast. Thank you for watching. We'll see you later. It was great being here, Hutto. I can't wait for the next match.